Hello and welcome to Coffee Talk with Kamisa Pajamas and our new musical director, Pluto. Thank you, Kamisa. And today we'll be interviewing the amazing conspiracy theorist, Uncle Carmine. Uncle Carmine, you. is yeah. there something in your childhood that led you to this, this field? When, when I was in camp, we had to go to these boring assemblies. My friends and I, decided to skip the assembly, wander through the woods. And we got caught. That's what happened. Wow. And basically, basically, all I can say is that the camp counselors at this stupid camp, <laughs> all, they, all they did all the time was take our youthful energy and squash it like I'm squashing this rat. Squash the youthful energy. That's all they do. They squash it. And the thing is, I started to realize that, well, they're, they're being squashed by an even higher power, their parents. And their parents are being squashed by a higher power, their bosses that's and true. their parents. And, it makes sense. That's it's not, a hierarchy of squashing. I see. But, but that's, not <laughs> that's not God's plan. God's plan for us is to be with the aliens. And the thing is, we can't be with the aliens because we're squashed down here. This is Earth. Well, I'm sorry. This is Earth, and we're squashed down. And the aliens are up here. You understand? Yes. We need to go up to the aliens. Yes. Off the Earth. That sounds plausible. That makes so much sense to me now. <laughs> yeah. It all fits together perfectly, right? I mean, awesome. And um, let's talk about today's word. Hmm. Today's is word. It, did I? Did I? Can I make it up today? Sure. Why, go go right ahead, Pluto. Today's word is going to be depository. Like the book Depository that uh, Lee Harvey Oswald shot JFK from in that movie. Kind of like Very. before a colonoscopy when you get a suppository? Very close, but very different. Okay. See how one of them goes up your butt and <laughs> one of them is not like that at all. All right, very well, very well, thank you. Have you seen The Matrix? Yes. Ooh. Okay, The Matrix is a ridiculous thing and what's going on is nothing like it, okay? It's basically the opposite of The Matrix. Well, Think of I The Matrix, it's the exact opposite. So it's like rainbow bright. The opposite of The Matrix. My Little Pony, Pokemon, could be any of those. My Little Pony, That's the, that was my next one I was going to. So compare and contrast. We're not controlled by machines, then, is what we're you're saying. We're controlled by machines that are controlled by aliens that are controlled by God. Basically. Wow. You want to know what? Yeah. That is like the most heaviest thing that I have not prepared myself for for this episode. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is very interesting. You never. In fact, it's so mind blowing that I have you these two never pills be here. And. Ooh. I'll take both. You will take both. Okay, so that means you will stay exactly as you are right now. Well, then fair enough. Which one would you take? The pink or the black? One will give you knowledge, and the other will make everything stop. Ooh. Oh, God. Well, I really know enough. Okay. Well, here. Do you have a third pill? I do not have a third pill. If you do have a third one, I will be taking that as well. These are the only two pills that we have. <laughs> you have become unprepared for this interview. You, you have taken us to new levels and new heights, for sure. Why, thank you very much. And in an effort to open my mind, I'm going to take this pill right now. Which one is that? This is the mind opening Wait, pill. Wait, are you sure? Oh. Didn't you say the pink one? 
<laughs> you know what, just take both and then let's, try it again. <laughs> let's put these down and think about it for next time. At some point, we should have a mantra session between the three of us where we definitely chant the, the teachings of Quattro. Yes, yes. That will be coming in our, one of our next episodes. We will have a chanting session with Carmine. We'll ch he will be leading this chanting session for all of us. Open and your mind. Yes, we will all open our mind. Open our mind. We will open our mind. Open our mind. We will open our mind. We will open our mind. We will open our mind. Open your mind. We will open our mind. Open your mind. We will open it. Open your mind. We will open it. We will open it. We will open our mind. <laughs> they are now open. Just like a door. Yes. To the new millennium. Yes, and we have forgotten mm -hmm. that since we have mentioned a Terminator, Arnold Schwarzenegger reference, it is time for a sip of coffee. <laughs> Hooray. Yeah, coffee. That is an homage to Arnold. Our hero. Mm -hmm. Very good. Get your ass to Mars. Oh. Um, I had a dream one night. Oh my God. With that bunny in it. You did? Yeah. Tell us more. Tell us more. <laughs> well, what happened was uh, I was working on these computer programs and somebody knocked on my door. And I was supposed to be giving them those computer programs. And they said, you look a little paler than usual. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, I might want to get out a little more. And uh, they said, you know, you should follow that white rabbit. And then that white rabbit showed up. <laughs> Followed that white wow. rabbit. Wow. And look at what we have. It's a white rabbit, everybody. Look at that. I wear it around my neck. Oh my goodness. It's for you to follow. It's a wow. Uncle hardcore. Carmine, you are truly a conspiracy yes, theorist. I am a conspiracy, not a theorist. I am a conspiracy, um, like, guy who knows it. I know it. <laughs> Your guide knows it. Great. I, I'm a guy who knows about conspiracies. They're not theories, okay? I don't know what this theory thing is. I see They're just cons this. conspiracies happen. They happen. Like, we're conspiring right now to make great entertainment for people. Yes. This is a conspiracy. Yes, this is all and fake. I agree. Conspiracies are real. <laughs> what, yes. what? I agree. This is real life. This Look around you. This is it. This is real. Yes. This, this is exactly what I do all day, every day, <laughs> right now. You don't exist outside, outside of this screen where I view you now. You think you do, but you're living in a simulation. Wow. So you, you think that you are real, but you're just an image on my computer screen. Same with Hack Guy. See, you know look, Zachariah Sitchin doesn't say that. Zachariah Sitchin <laughs> says that the Anunnaki came down and was like, hey, you all like, you're gonna, you're gonna be infatuated with gold because you need to make gold for the aliens. Listen, and then Zachariah, the aliens will come down and they will capture all the gold and bring it back to their planet. Zachariah snitching. I know him. He's a chump. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you for coming on our, our show. And, and we're very happy that you were able to share your thoughts and um, unusual ideas. And, and we'd love for you to come again. Thank you. Pluto. Thank you for having me. I hope that I see you all again and that um, we're not murdering the streets for having this conversation. <laughs> Thank you again. <laughs> Thank you all. Coffee talk, 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 coffee. We've got me so much yeah. Thank you.